case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for baker v bailey a 1989 montana supreme court case spotlighted the legal principle that oral agreements cannot be used in court as evidence when a written contract exists unless fraud or coercion can be demonstrated this feud between the baileys and the bakers centered on a water well use agreement this agreement granted the Baileys access to water on their property, but this right did not extend to any future owners. When issues with the water system arose, the Baileys found themselves grappling with water shortages while the bakers continued with normal water usage and refused to share. Brokered into a corner, the Baileys eventually sold their property to the bakers who had the right of first refusal. In the initial trial, the district court sided with the Baileys. The bakers were found in breach of the contract and the implied covenant of good faith. However, it didn't imply full victory for the Baileys, as the court limited the damages awarded and declined to procure attorney fees. An appeal transferred the case to the Montana Supreme Court. The higher court disagreed with the district court, finding that the Bakers had not breached the water well use agreement. Thereby, they committed no violation. Therefore, the Baileys held no grounds for demanding damages. While the Baileys were excused from an array of electrical expenses that had piled up, they could not claim repair costs after the property had been sold to the bakers. The Supreme Court upheld the lower court's stipulation on limiting damages and awarding attorney fees and sent the case back to the district court for further proceedings in line with their judgment. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for Visit LSE.law Elevate your mind Leave the stress of class